Okay, here we are. Episode three. Donnelly did not pass through the caves. From here on in, his guidance, unreliable as it is, has gone from me. Oh, snap. I understand now that it is between the two of us and whatever correspondence could be drawn from the wet Oh. 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 Hello, darkness. Hello, terror. Hello. Where did these candles come from? What the heck? I did not light this freaking candle. Where did we fall from exactly? Oh, that would be where we fell from. Jeez. Oh, Alright. Alright, you guys. Whew. Look at the phosphorescence reflecting in the pool. This is gorgeous. Th there's that... Mmm! There's those creepy glow-in-the-dark drawings again. Alright. Onward. Ho. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's see what there is to see. Didn't we? Mmm. Okay. We've been that way before. This music. I don't even know what to say. This game is so beautiful. The music is so haunting. I mean, uh, what could my commentary possibly add to that moment that we just had? And I didn't really intend for that to rhyme, but it did. So there we have it. It's a creepy stalagmite. All right, once again, sorry about that slightly odd transition. We, um... I don't even really know what's happening. My computer was just being a little dirtbag and I needed to change a couple settings and ooh la la. What are we looking at? I just really... There is no other direction. No other exit from this motorway. Uh. Speeding past this junction, I saw you waiting at the roadside. A one last drink in your trembled hands. So creepy. I mean, is this... What are these drawings? I mean, they're kind of beautiful, but also very, very odd. Somebody commented on my first video of the series, and there's Hobbs, and they said that this is a, the chemical compound that we saw on the wall of the first cave is a, is alcohol, known as ester, E-S-T-E-R, which should help explain the game a little bit, or known as an ester, and that freaking cat, I swear. Pete's sake. Is there no other way out of here? Is that... Is that what he was trying to say? What's here in the middle? What do we have here? Can we get up to these? Up to the candles? That... Uh, the fact that there are lit candles weirds me out to no end. Come on. Let me out. 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 Oh my gosh. I'm gonna kill that cat. He's so, like, perfectly quiet until the moment I start recording. And then... Oh, which way did we come from? Pretty sure we came from there. So we're going to go this way. Up and out. Look at the barnacles. I mean, they're not barnacles, but like, look at the barnacle markings. This is just so gorgeous. And it's being ruined by a loud kitty. It's being absolutely ruined. This looks dangerous. Oh, jeez. Do we have to... Do we have to jump? I'm like, I'm like looking for my shift key to crouch. Oh, that's stupid. It's embarrassing. Sorry, I'm looking for my shift key to like crouch. And Hobbs is freaking out. And you know what? There's water down there. Let's just jump. Geronimo! Wait, Q. Q is my swim upward key. Q. Oh, wow. Look at this. Look at this. All right, all right. Look, I mean, seriously, the water. The water's so beautiful. The light. The light in this cave. It's unreal. Absolutely unreal. These people are freaking artists and poets. Seriously, get this game, you guys. Look at this. Look at the colors. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna stop raving for like two seconds. Um, Alright, through the caves. 
This is like legit awesome. I don't think I can walk through here. I don't think I can. All right, give me two seconds. I gotta go kill my cat. Okay, sorry about that. And I'm back. Man, that cat. Sometimes he just... It's like, I think he's totally adorable. And then he'll flip out right when I start recording. Just because he, like, is angry that Sigil's shut him out of the office. Or for, you know, really any reason. And... Wait. Oh, okay, okay. Which way? Which way? Can we go up at all? No. Can't go up. Oh, jeez. We're totally going to fall down there, aren't we? I don't think we can make it around this corner without falling. We've already been... We've already fallen into that pool, though, right? Right? This is... This is new. We came out there. We couldn't see this. Look at how these maps are put together. When we first came out of that hole right there, that bit of cave, and we went up that way, or wherever we went, we couldn't even see this cave here. I mean, the, the the design of the different chambers and rooms in ways that lead you through the world without, you know, laying it all out for you at the beginning are really fascinating. I'm, I'm intrigued by the, the world structure, the map structure. Oh my goodness. Can we, can we get through here? Can we fit? Oh, okay. Oh, we're crouching. The crouch is automatic. I feel like I'm honestly not doing enough. All I'm doing is walking through this beautiful world. Look at these little mushrooms. Beautiful. All right, so today, what did I do today? Like, I want to tell you these stories about my day, but they're all kind of stupid stories, so it's like they might ruin In my the my final dream, I sat at peace with Jacobson and watched the moon over the Sandford Junction. Goats grazed on the hard shoulder. The world gone to weed and redemption. He showed me his fever scars, and Oof. I mine. Between each shoulder, the nascency of flight. Nascency of flight. I mean, jeez. That's poetry. Right there. What is to be seen this way? It's kind of difficult. They don't normally give you this many decisions on which direction to walk. Looks like we might be hitting a dead end up here before too much longer, though. Well, those arrows are telling us to go that way. But, um, we'll keep walking this way, at least for a little while longer. Oh, look. More paint cans. It's difficult to know what is natural phosphorescence and what... What is this paint? What is to be seen? Okay, there's not really much to see back here. I don't think, nope, we can't fit all the way into there. Can we climb up here on the rocks? Nope. Okay. We will wade in the water till we get to a shallow point. Anyway, um, today I spilled a coffee in my car and it, it like, I pretty much, the lid wasn't all the way on and I pretty much dumped the entire coffee into my cup holders you know, like right between the two front seats. And I was actually kind of glad I dumped it in there because I was able to just get it all mopped up and Windex the whole thing. Whereas if I had gotten any of it on the carpet, I would have had to shampoo the whole car and that would have been a problem. And that would have been very time consuming, but still it was just like sad because I didn't get to drink my coffee and gross because my cup holders were like literally full, full of drink. So clearly we're supposed to go up this way, but what if there's something around there that's interesting? It's probably not. So fascinating. Someone came and drew all these. The question is who? Is it me or is it some other character? Or I don't. I honestly don't know what to make of this. Oh. Mm. Mm hmm. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. So how are you lovely, lovely people? I hope you're enjoying this game as much as I am, because this, I mean, if nothing else, the sheer gorgeousness of the, this map should be should be getting to you, because it's certainly getting to me. I'm, I'm kind of, at some point, speechless. Whoa! Phosphorescent barnacles. Further up and further in? Or this way? Oh, is this just going to be another... Chamber? This is a drowned man's face reflected in the moonlit waters. 
It can only be a dead shepherd who has come to drunk drive you home. What is... What is happening? How deep is this? It looks kind of deep. Which way? Which way? Well, there's a cloud. Or is that... Is that a cloud? Is that the outside? Which way? Which way? I think we should go this way. These candles. The candles are honestly creeping me out. I don't know what to make of them. I mean, it's a little weird, am I right? Whoa. Okay, what does that say? I mean, that word there looks like Damascus. Taken? Whoa, okay. Uh, I'm officially very creeped out. Like, creeped... Is that... Is that circuitry or is that more chemistry? I'm creeped out right now in a way that I haven't been since like that first creepy moment of the game. Um, the music is definitely helping with that. Oh gosh. This is like terrifying right now. Away from being... Away from being a city? A something and it shall be a ruinous keep I can't like make out this handwriting exactly it's very kind of ambiguous I'm probably gonna go back later and read those and they'll be clear as day just like the writing on that ship where when I gave it another look it was the easiest thing in the world to read what do we have here Huh. Huh. Wow, check out this this light. Are we gonna be able to go or are we stuck? Is this is this a dead end? Is this a dead end? Kinda looks that way, doesn't it? Yeah, it's that's a dead end if I ever saw Oh! Or not a dead end. What if we die? What if we're so totally gonna die? Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! <sighs> Whoa, okay, okay. Where? Is this taking us? All right. I'm paying attention. You have my attention. Oh, incredible game. Waterfalls. Is this is this the very top of that hole? Yes. That would be the very top of the hole. Part of me wants to jump down it. I mean, but like if it's the exact same place, I don't really want to walk up the entire way, all the way again. Huh. Well, we're at a crossroads. Do we jump? I'm willing to bet it's the exact same hole. What if we die? Or, no, that's, that's definitely water. Mm, you know what? I can't be standing here on this ledge and not jump. <gasps> oh! Oh, dear. Swimming, swimming, swimming. I'm holding my Q button. Holding Q. Am I about to die? I'm dying. I'm totally dying right now. Don't die. Oh, I didn't die. Didn't die, that's for sure. Have I been here before? No, this is this is different, I think. At least maybe. Seems kind of different. Come on. Swim, swim, just keep swimming. I'm so lost right now. I mean, there's no, there's no map. There's no map to look, look through. Um, but I'm pretty sure we're about to head out. I almost wish I'd gone the other way, though. I mean, and I, I took the road less traveled by, or more traveled by, or I don't even know what to say. But that was an adventure. I'm glad I, I'm glad I jumped. I'm glad I jumped. I would have regretted not jumping. That's absolutely for sure. You know when you have that feeling and you're standing on a high ledge and you get oh, I thought for a second that was going to be a drop and you get that urge to throw something valuable off it or there's that little nagging voice in the back of your head that just says jump, 